Uh oh, guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Huh? Anybody? Julie, hey, guess what day it is? Oh, come on, I know you can hear me. Welcome to Wednesday Glads. My name is Abby Lorbecki. And I'm Mercy Trujillo. And this is your KWHS News. College reps continue to visit us. George Mason University closes out the month with a visit today. October's visits start off with Pikes Peak Community College on October 4th, Grand Canyon University on October 6th, then Western State University on October 11th, and Fort Hayes State University on October 12th. In November, UNC Greeley will stop by on the 1st, DU will be here on the 8th, and Lamar Community College will stop by on the 10th. And CSU for Collins will end the month with a visit on November 17th. Remember to get a pass from the Counseling Center to attend any of these sessions. Senior photos and baby ads are due on October 21st. See Ms. Kennedy for details. Abby. If you are interested in taking the PSAT test on Saturday, October 15th, you need to sign up in the Counseling Center by noon on October 13th. The cost is $15 and is due at sign up. Space is limited. Remember that the PSAT test is not mandatory, but a PSAT test your junior year is required if you have any intentions of trying for the very difficult merit scholarship. The test will be from 8 a.m. to noon. Hey, Miss Betsy, what's for lunch? Good morning. It's Wednesday, and today we're having lasagna with a breadstick. Come by and see us. Thanks, and have a great day. Bye-bye. That sounds like a great lunch. All teachers and students, if you have a relative who graduated from my field and is currently on active duty in the military, please bring in any photo of them, including their rank and the year they graduated, to the NJROTC room 125. Now here's Elijah and Dylan with your sports update. Good morning, Glads. I'm Elijah Clark. And I'm Dylan Ham. And this is your Gladiator Sports Update. The girls Basketball Open Gym start Monday, October 3rd from 6 to 7.30 p.m. in Bowers Gym. And will continue on Mondays and Wednesdays until the season starts in November. Varsity Soccer had a match against Sierra at home yesterday and rode the Salians to victory. The Lady Glads softball team played Harris and tamed the Panthers. The Football Booster Club is raffling off a signed jersey. Buccaneers wide receiver and Whitefield graduate Vincent Jackson tickets can be purchased at any varsity football game. The tickets are one for three dollars, two for five dollars, or five for ten dollars. The drawing is at the last home game of the season. Finally, this Friday is our annual color game. Make sure you wear a white t-shirt. Make sure you wear sunglasses to protect your eyes. I'm Dylan Ham, And I'm Elijah Clark. Have an excellent Wednesday. Back to you, Abby and Marissa. Thanks boys. Stand up for your right to read an entry contest through the library. To enter, check out a book that has been banned in another school. Enter again by writing a review about the book you read. You have until this Saturday the 1st to do so. Winners will be announced Tuesday the 4th. Another contest will be the Security Public Library's Annual Story Contest. This year's contest will be a picture prompt story, which can be seen at the library or at the Security Public Library's website. For more information, go to the library, their website, or your English teacher. The first prize winner will get a $50 Barnes & Noble gift card, and the second prize winner will receive a $25 Barnes & Noble gift card as well. Remember, Glass, that Friday is picture retake from 10 to 12 in the small gym. Please bring your picture packet back if you need retakes. Also, if you have not had your picture taken for an ID or the yearbook, please stop by. Have a great Wednesday, Gladiators. I'm Abby Lorbecki. And I'm Marissa Trill, and this was your KWHS News. It's hump day. Hump day!